Welcome to episode 3 of the Sesco Player Career Mode. If you did miss last episode, it was mixed. So we did lose the Super Cup to Bayern Munich and we played absolutely awful. But a Bayern Leverkusen 2-0 win on the opening day of the Bundesliga. It was a perfect result against a pretty good team. If you've seen them in real life, you'll know Leverkusen are not to be laughed at at all. But... To start today's episode, we're actually going to do some investing. So you can't see it, but I've got £250,000. And I'm going to be using that to be investing. I've been looking at all of these, and I think I've decided I want to invest in sport equipment. I want high-risk investment. I want the best return for my money. I'm happy to risk it. We're earning every single week anyway. So we've invested in some sports equipment. But other than that... It's just time for the first game of the season. How are we lining up? It's a good, strong team. Other than the keeper, is 69 rated. I'm not sure about that part. But Pender, Simmons, Olmo and Sesco is a front four. You can't really go wrong with that. It's at home as well. I'm confident. Let's get into the game and hopefully get a couple goals and a solid win. We've made that pass a little bit nicer. And now Simmons in behind to Sesco. Yeah. Oh, no, we're offside, we're offside, we're offside. Okay, let's calm down, let's calm down. But what a finish that was, by the way. Great ball from Xavi. Look at that, little chip over the top. We've seen that a couple times already. Oh, and I mean, that is, oh my God, that is so close. There's a lot of space still in behind. They're not tracking runs very well at all. So if we can find that one when we're onside, it could be dangerous. We played that lovely in there. Get the shot off. That's a big save, but again, it's promising attack and play from us. Nil-nil. We've looked like the better team, but the scoreline doesn't show that yet. We have had, obviously, two goals disallowed. One was very, very close and a bit unlucky. The other one was just an awfully timed run. But more of the same, I think a goal will be coming. We're on a 7.5. Oh, no, sorry. We're on a 6.5. We need a 7.5. So we haven't been the best. But if we keep going, I feel like we're going to get a big opportunity. And this time, it won't be offside. We need a bit of support. We found it. Can Xavi Simmons find us back? We might call for it down here. That might work. There we go. Great play there. We're trying to offer support. But I don't know what he's tried there. He kind of just ran into them. That's a great challenge from us. Appenda. Oh my God. Is that an assist? Surely. Oh my God. Because we didn't press, press pass. I don't think it's gone down as an assist. But what more could we have done? Either way, an unbelievable challenge after we played some really nice football. And that has led to a great finish. Look at that for a challenge. Getting stuck in. Just inside the box, a cross goal. What a finish that is from a pender. Oh my god. We'll keep giving the ball if he's going to keep doing that. I'm going to try going behind again, see if they can stop it. They can't. Volley! Oh my god, again, inches. How many of them have we seen already this game? Oh my god, look at that for technique. Literally a young Van Persie in the making. And that should be the game, ref. You've got to blow up. Look at the minute. Come on, ref. Don't make any stupid decisions. That's got to be game. And it is a 1-0 win. We kind of got an assist, but it won't go down as one, sadly. But we were pivotal to win that goal. And that is two games played, two wins, and zero goals conceded for RB Leipzig. An absolutely perfect start to this episode. But who are we facing next? That is the big question. As you can see here, the gap is very happy with that performance. But what I'm actually going to do is, so over the next games, I'm just going to show any key highlights. And then we'll jump in for every, like, two, three games for some more extended highlights. Just to be able to get through it a little bit quicker. This first game was against Augsburg. And we started off with some good opportunities. Like this one right here. Look at that throw on goal. It's a big save from the keeper and just about misses the target. But then, look at this from us. The great ball in behind that we've seen so many times and you know we don't miss those when we're that close great finish and that sealed off a massive one nil win at home to augsburg still haven't conceded in the league this game though is against union berlin and again it's filled with some chances early doors look how good this play is it goes out wide finds me indoors first touch shot and it's almost ended up in but some more good play down the right hand side. We are looking for the ball inside. We get it. We play it inside. And just like that, we have an assist and a 1 0 lead, which is really massive as we still haven't conceded. But that may be coming to an end here as they get in behind a big shot. It's a big save. And now 
we may have an opportunity to counter. It's thrown up to me. Great touch. Great ball out wide. We receive it back. What can we do? We go for a little diag. It's not perfect, but it's good enough to work. Xavi Simmons somehow gets past his man. He plays it inside. Look at that cut inside. Finish. 2-0. First goal of the game. We got an assist for the first one. We're on absolute fire. Amazing goal. But for this, I'm going to be quiet and just let you watch. But that absolute screamer sealed a 3-0 win away to Union Berlin. And that's four games in the league. And we haven't conceded a single goal. Things are going absolutely perfect. As you can see, we're now back and ready for a big Champions League game. Our first one of the season. And we're in absolute form. Some of those goals we just scored were absolutely crazy. So if we carry that over into the Champions League, this should be a nice and easy first game of the group stage let's get into it fingers crossed we carry over that league form it's a nice play Xavi Simmons in the box plays it one back he receives it back now what can he do out wide back into Xavi Simmons why has he played it oh are we that close again but I'm not sure why he's played it I feel like he could have went alone there if anything he stiffed us up a bit there because we weren't expecting that at all but it's a close chance at early doors see the ball now Cutting, lovely. Can we get that shot off? Oh my god, it's another big save. But we're getting closer and closer. It's still only 23 minutes in. And that's a few big chances already. Receive the ball now. Can we chip it out wide? It's a good ball. What's he going to do? He's hit it. Oh my god, that's always bounced off the keeper and went in. But that is the first half complete. It's a very, very positive first half. No goals yet. But if we keep playing how we are, it's a matter of time. It's a matter of when, not if. Let's get straight into the second half and keep up that momentum. Okay, Xavi Simmons on the ball now. Made it into a pender. Into Olmo. Into us. We're in behind. Champions League. First goal. Oh, my God. The keeper has stopped it once again. He will not stop saving our shots. Again, that's nice stuff. In behind with the header. Oh, my God. This keeper. Again, we just can't get anything past him. Oh no. Is he onside? Oh my god. The 87th minute. I thought he was offside. And just like that, we have, well, potentially lost. They've got people invading the pitch. And we've been all over them. But we must have missed, personally, about six, seven chances. And that man there saved each and every one of them. And they've made us pay really late on. Champions League is just different gravy. It's the first goal we've conceded other than the Super Cup. We've gone clean sheet in every single league game. And look at that, literally from like just edge of the box. What a finish. He's shown us how it's meant to be done. But hopefully there's something still in this game. But no, there wasn't anything left in the game. And an 88th minute goal has sealed our fate. We lose our opening game of the group stage in the Champions League. And we are basically to blame. We missed so many opportunities. There was way, way, way too many one-on-ones, volleys, headers, all of that saved by their keeper. And that has led to us losing our first game, which is a real, real shame. But with a bit of a disappointing performance, that is where we're going to leave it for this episode. If you have enjoyed, make sure to like, subscribe, turn on notifications. And if you are new to this series, why not watch this video right here? It's episode one and you can watch it all the way through. And you won't be too late because we're only on episode three at the minute. Best time to restart the series. But if you've made it this far, thanks for watching. And until next time, goodbye.